what's happening everybody it's uh, as you can see a little foggy out here not really too bad um, it's actually turned out to be um, a nice morning besides the fog obviously you guys can see that my stability yada 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 thing again well as it turns out I hooked it up to the scanner and um, exactly as I think it is it's obviously the passenger front um, wire harness to the wheel bearing uh, it's got low or no voltage um, what ended up happening is just a little ways down the road that way probably about four days ago I think is what it was um, there was a big pothole that was getting worse as people were driving and I think in a previous video I mentioned that a truck kind of went off the road a little bit because where the 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 pothole was was as you're turning so when you're turning and that tire suddenly loses the road then you have to rely on your other tire to keep you going in that same direction well unfortunately if you're taking that corner just a little bit too fast then you lose control so um, normally you can kind of get around it if there's no cars coming from the other side but kind of moving over into the other lane a little bit but when I hit it I wasn't able to move over as soon as I hit it I mean it was a loud crash I mean I actually pulled into the apartment complex that was just up the way just to make sure that my tire didn't uh, get all fucked up or fricked up oh, I'm sorry um but um so yeah as soon as it, it so whatever happened I don't know if the suspension travel went too far and it ended up uh, ripping up my um, fix but this is permanent now it hasn't gone away so I'm obviously going to be fixing that maybe possibly today I'm not really sure I'm gonna try if I can get time I'll get around to it because it's actually not that big of a deal to fix it and then if you can hear, which I mentioned in the last video, if you can hear that little kind of grinding sound. Well, as it turns out, my fan blade for my blower motor is actually wobbling a little bit. And I can't figure out why. <clears throat> it's, um, it's actually kind of weird. Ah, damn. That sucked. It's actually kind of weird that it is wobbling like it is and it's causing it to hit barely hit you can probably hear it a little bit it's causing it to barely hit the outside of the hole um so anyway i gotta get that fixed as well uh, wow that's an old bus Those kind of buses there, people fix up and turn them into uh, homes or motor homes or things like that. Um, so anyway, yeah, I've got to get that fixed. Uh, shoot, I had went to a party last night for the we had a company party, and it was just amazing, and. Um, took a friend with me it was just a really fun night that's the latest I've stayed out in a long time and and uh, yeah I just just had all sorts of fun um, so well there's a lot of travel buses coming through here I don't know what's going on in town I think there's some <clears throat> there was some kind of a, a magic Johnson thing going on down at the Lansing Center some I don't know what it was but anyway that you know that was happening um, some kind of fundraiser I think <clears throat> all right I'm gonna get gas real quick well that gas station over there was packed so I just decided that uh, I was just gonna go somewhere um, else right down the street is another speedway I usually go here but when I first pulled up it looked like it was okay but I don't like to take the diesel pumps I honestly don't yeah 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 and uh, I wish I would have got it on camera but there was a um, 
Monte Carlo SS that uh, was parked over there. I heard it start up, and of course, when you know the sound of the LS4, and they had an exhaust system, it sounded like um, Flowmaster or something. It wasn't Magnaflow, I know exactly what they sound like. But anyway, um, what I'm finding more and more is that um, people who buy these cars that have the LS4, they really don't care. <laughs> It's a car, and it's got a V8, whoop de do. Nobody's into the, it's got extra power, it sounds great. Um, you know, it's, they've come down in price so much that it's just like going down to, you know, Bob and Tom's auto lot and just getting it for 5,000 cash. I mean, really, it's gotten to that point, sadly. Um, is anybody else turning? You can never tell, because fucking half the people in the world don't use their turn signals. So, anyways, uh, I get a gas heading home. So, how is everyone doing? I know that the videos have been so slow coming in, and I'm really sorry. I mean, I'm just, I'm just dealing with a lot of different things right now. videos that I want to do. She's been working a lot on the computer. And well, I think it was Monday maybe. I had a short video driving back or whatever. And I haven't even been able to sit down and edit it, as sad as that sounds. And I'm working so many hours now that my my window of being able to actually do any videos, to actually sit down and edit them and so on, is very small. My 360 camera is full. It's completely full and so I am just unable to I mean I've got literally almost two hours worth of uh, footage on here that I need to edit down and I just haven't been able to I haven't been, I mean two hours think about that it takes to render one video just to get it onto the computer just so that I can edit it that doesn't include editing that's just getting it to the computer um, it's one to one so it'll take two hours for me to get all the footage off of this and onto the computer and then I can edit it as sad as that sounds you can't just raw copy it over um, it has to be formatted in a certain format and resolution in order for it to actually be compatible to not only edit but to get to YouTube and then there's the spherical processing that you have to throw on top of it so YouTube understands it I mean it's just um, it's very time-consuming which is you know, part of the reason I'm not running it right now. I've got this thing's full. And I'd love to just keep on buying SD cards and filling them up, but it's not gonna help me any. I'm gonna have a huge backlog. Anyway, I'll catch you guys later. So, hope you enjoyed the quick drive. Take care.